So here I am today with Dick, or is it Rick? Dick. Dick. <laughs> Dick, tell me a little bit about yourself. Um, I'm an artist, how about that, and a delivery person. So I get into a lot of businesses around Winnipeg, and uh, I just moved here three years ago from Regina. I talk to a lot of people who've been vaccinated, and I am alarmed at how little they know. I know. And I mean, I'm talking about stuff like the two vaccines. A lot of people think this is two vaccinations and hello, freedom. And then we're done. Yeah, no, it's not like that at all. And I'm telling them, and I've got this information posted on my vehicle. I'm like, you guys, you're getting a third shot probably in the fall. Your vaccination. You'll get another one in the spring. <laughs> yep. Maybe another one in the winter. Trudeau just bought something like, or, or placed orders for 300 million more yep. vaccinations. And I think even on the vaccine cards, there's extra lines in there for the future ones. my friends uh, back home all the time um, the first I just moved here three years ago the first two and a half years or so I had a lot of positives to say about Winnipeg I hadn't set foot in Manitoba in 25 years so I have a lot of positives to say about Winnipeg lots of good camping around here and everything now that is flipped recently I've been making videos and I've been encouraging people to spread them across Canada because people across Canada don't know what's going on here and this is the guinea pig so I'm warning my friends I'm like all of the other premiers are watching what's happening here. They finally have someone to talk to. And I keep hearing this story all the time. They're looking for leaders. They're looking for people who will signal to you them know, and have a different message I, that I says agree. it is okay to be pro-choice on vaccination. See, human beings are very tribal in nature. We heard we, we need to fit in and we need to connect with others. That's part of our nature. Yep. And when you don't have that and you're on your own, it's it's you're gonna sit there quietly and not say anything and you're gonna be isolated, become depressed. And yep. it's so important. That's what these rallies are all about, is for us to feel that connection yep. and, and to let everybody know that we're all on the same page. Thank you, see? I just want to say thank you so much for chatting with me today. Really sure. Much appreciated. And just like I said, uh, we got to stick together, support each other. And you're Dick Eastland, Dick Eastland on yeah. Facebook. Make sure you follow him. And look out for the van that's got the Batman and the Robin. You will see it. Believe me, I'm all over the city. Awesome.